Welcome back to Wasteland 3, folks. We rescued Ironclad Cordite in the last one, and now we are checking out what I think is the last room down here. Yeah. There is this, uh... These frog things down here, which I'm not sure that we're gonna mess with, because they seem nasty. But we'll see. So let's... Uh, do a quick save and take a look in here. More bad guys. More bad guys. Yeah, all right. Well, there isn't really any cover around, so I guess we're just. What the hell was all that gunfire? Nobody should have gotten here. No, that's true, but we did. So let's head in. There's no cover anywhere. None. So I guess we're, we're just fighting. I guess we're just fighting. How close can we get? They, they don't notice anything. Hmm. Okay. Well. Oh, we can try and talk to them. Okay. So you're the ones who've been shooting up the place. Yep. That's us. Uh, who's that man in the bed? Sorry, wrong room. Uh, nobody who's that talks to the guests, and nobody wanders in here without permission. We got our orders. Yeah, yeah. All right. Moving to cover. I guess we're fighting. Ow! You see ya. All right, Lucia, you definitely need to heal up. Okay, you have a penetration of 13. That's not enough for that guy, but it is enough for that guy. So if you come up here, then you can definitely shoot him. But you're gonna. Alright, and then you can defend. Alright, so then we have Cordite. How much penetration does he have? 10. Not enough. Not enough. We move over here, we can take one shot. It's not a good one. This is much better shot. So let's take it. Okay. I guess... I guess pull back a bit. What's that? What's that? I have no idea. Who pick lock? Eight. Ooh. Uh, Cordite. Uh, let's wait with him. I have the penetration needed, but not a great shot from here. It's much better from there. No, like this. Nice. <sighs> Cheap. Right, he's dead. And we still have a shot, but I want to get in some cover. Suppose this is some kind of cover. Hawk, you could do with a heal. Alright. 
And then you just run up here, I think, because you can't get in range of anyone. Defend. Zeus. Your penetration is 10, so let's take a shot at this guy. Good hit. Defend. Cordite. You need to get in close to... So let's get you in some cover here. And next time... You'll... Ooh. Miss. Oh. So pop. Hey, leave the chicken alone. Oh, I missed. The chicky missed. All right. So we want those with the highest. Penetration to hit this guy. Nice. That's because we have the um, the skill that the second shot at anyone is always a crit, which is a really nice skill. Let's defend. Penetration nineteen. So let's just deal with the saw pop. Nice. And defend. Actually, ambush. Torrent strike. Try to try drop this ability with each of the sacrifice right, right. Death in a wide area. I'm not going to do that. Good hits, though. Good hits. Defend. On. Actually, Lucia, why don't you finish this guy off? Thank you. And then we can do a precision strike on this guy. To the face. Nice. Alright, that means Quan. really like you to have eight left. But you won't have that. So let's just come up here and we can precision strike him to the face. That's him down. No, oh, he didn't go down. That uh, leaves Cordite. Defend, and Lucia, defend. Another saw pop. What's the chicken doing? Okay. Let's take that thing out. Hit that thing. Ally down. That's right, dude. Ally down. Seventy seven percent hit chance over here. But it leaves her with only one shot. I guess we'll take it. 
Miss Lucia. That's not good. Twenty two per cent hit chance. Man, this guy is in good cover. Let's see, you get back here. Cordite. You can get in there and hit him once. He's bleeding. So that's something. And just pull back a bit. Walk. Pull back a bit. Shit. Call the recruiter. <laughs> oh, Cordite took some friendly fire there. He didn't go down though, so that's okay. Oh, nice hit, check. Like this. Thirty-nine percent. All right. Let's just let Cordite finish it. Finish. There we go. Good, good. Hawk, you heal up Cordite. And we have some level ups, so let's take a look at that. Uh, that's a fake level up, and that's a fake level up, but this is a real level up. So what are we going to do with her? Hmm. Hmm. I wouldn't mind getting her bar skill up. Let's do that. And her small arms is coordination, luck, and awareness. Hmm. I think we'll go with coordination to get her that extra AP next turn or next time she levels up. All right. Well, let's loot. Ooh, Medheim, oh nice. Official looking letter. A finely penned letter signed by the Patriarch. Lore book, okay. Meddar and a burned book. Crap, crap. What's that? Old handkerchief. Junk, junk. Bit of ammo, money and junk. Nothing too sexy. Should check on the guy who's sick. Uh, oh, trooper hammer. Uh, nah, not bad, not bad. Okay. Anything else in here? Yeah, there's an ammo box. And we, of course, need to get into this room. Which we can. Medical crate and a ammo box. Okay. Well, that was an anti Advanced materials mag. Weapon mod magazine requires weapon modding eight. Minus one AP to load, but magazine minus size minus one. Why is magazine size minus one? That ah, okay, I get it. So you get less ammo, but. It doesn't take as much 
AP to reload. Put all. Ooh, a creepy doll. Fucking Fred. He hates all people with his soul, so he rages like a great asshole. <laughs> Grants bonus to all squad members. Damage versus humans, plus 5%. I like it. I'll grab that. What? what? What's that? There's something down there. Oh, it's a dead guy who fell through, through the floor. Okay. Alright, so... If we take a look at our archive, we only have two creepy dolls, I think. Yeah. Fucking Fred and Radical Rachel. Okay. Want more creepy dolls? Alright, let's try and talk to this guy. Clouds drifting west. In the bed lies a broken old man, dying from multiple terrible injuries and breathing only because of a machine. His eyes roll towards you as you approach. The ironclad. He nods feebly at Cordite. I know this one. Seems he was also betrayed by Buchanan. Take me out of here, ironclad. I must die under the sky. Uh... uh. Uh, who are you? It is not mercy that keeps me from killing you for not knowing my name. My body betrays me. I was supposed to know your name, dude. We haven't met you before. I am Clouds Drifting West, leader and prophet of the Godfishers, slayer of unbelievers. Launcher of a thousand kites. Okay. Holy. I've heard of this guy. Everybody who fought in the Plains Wars knows what he did. He's killed more people than hunger. <laughs> That's a lot of people. Uh, why are you here? Cannon's daughter turned my people against me. They beat me. Broke my bones, but I escaped. Came okay. here, ordered Buchanan to make good on our deal. He turns his back and drags me here. It seems like the patriarch is kind of a dick. I made the same mistake. May lightning. Strike him. Yeah. Uh, you had to deal with the patriarch? <laughs> he paid me tribute so that I would not raid his lands. Men, women, he delivered to us. So I guess that's the slavers. Offerings for kites. Raise them to the... Gods. What? Are you serious? You think he is not capable? A man who rules with a, a hammer? You are lying. The Patriarch would never trade innocent lives for security. I'm afraid he would, Lucia. <laughs> Believe what you want. Cordite told the very much the same story, right? So... <laughs> Always wondered what his deal with you was. Uh, the Patriarch gave you human beings in tribute? Who were these people? Don't know. Didn't care. Just blood to bait the gods down from the sky. Not buying it. Never heard about anything like this, and I hear all the dirt. At least I think I do. <laughs> <laughs> That's the problem. You think you do. And if we take out you out of the out of bed, you'll die before we leave the room. Then end my life here. Better than waiting. All right, we'll end your suffering. Cut off the machine beside my bed. Gods, prepare. 
share my welcome. I am coming home. All right. Let's take a look at the life support machine. The only thing keeping this broken old man alive is this life support machine. Uh, turn off the machine. The old man chokes and bucks, fighting for air, but to no avail. As he dies, his eyes find, find yours. They do not shut. Okay. Well, I'm sorry, dude. I think we have uh, checked everything here. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. I guess we're out of here. Now, now the question is, do we, where was it? It was over here. Do we go down and try and take out these frogs? Is there any point in going down and taking out these frogs? Uh, there's a thing there too, right? Yep. Yeah. Uh, so I think we'll take them out one by one so they don't... Look alive! Oh. Whoever took out the other shit could still be around. Oh shit! It's the Desert Rangers! Pull back! Do not engage! The <laughs> keep this money. Nice! Got ourselves a bit of a rep. Is that everyone? No. Oh, yeah, Marshal Kwan here as well. That's everyone, right? Three, six, yeah. Right? Yeah. There are worse places to ride out an apocalypse. Can't we get to toaster repair? Ah, oh, no, because we... we... We don't have a toaster repair guy at the moment. That kind of sucks. Okay. Now, do we go down here to these things? Look at all that health. 947. 1,055, 947, they're poisonous, they're nasty, there's something over here, let's come down as far as this. Oh, what's that stick? Is there anything in here? There, there is something, there's a... Storage of some kind here. Look at the man. How many are there? One, two, three, four, five. Five frogs. There's a fuse box. Ooh. Can we perhaps sneaky shit in there and do something? It doesn't look like there's anything here except those pamphlets, though. And there's a weapon crate. That weapon crate is enough to make me consider going in and attacking them, to be honest. Oh, and there's a door. Oh, that goes up to this room. Oh, so I guess we could have uh, maybe rescued him out of here or something? Or at least talk to him. Okay. I wonder if we could sneaky shit in here, turn this on somehow, and maybe fry all these frogs? Uh, 
who is our sneaky shit guy? Do we have a sneaky shit guy? Yeah, we do, but he can't really do anything with his sneaky shit. Which is a problem. We need to get him, like... Lock picking or explosives or something. Mechanics. I guess we're going in. Right? Right. There's no cover for you there, so you go over there. Cordite. Lucia. She's gonna need to be up front, and so is Cordite for that matter. Juan. Hawk needs to be up front. Ooh, and there's a... Ooh. Let's take a look at this safe before we do anything. Scourer flamethrower. 28 to 42 damage. Runs extremely hot. Okay. Some explosive bolts. Not bad. Now, Zeus, oh, you have that. Might actually be useful to t set these guys on fire. But I don't know if it is. Do we have a uh, Quan? Who can do animal whispering thing? Can anyone do animal whispering? No. All right, great. Wonderful. One. Come over here. Zeus. Two thousand health. Ah, oh, it's out of range. Time for your wake up. All right, I guess we're in combat. Guess we're in combat. Um, but how much armor do these guys have? Wait, none. Well, that's something. That's something. And their body reduces armor. Legs reduces the target's combat speed. Inflicts bleeding. I, I think I'll just take the extra damage, to be honest. Hawk. You come up here for now. And ambush. Zeus. You don't have enough action points. Let's prepare. One. Then Lucia Need to get up here to get a shot. Well I guess you're coming up here then. And you can take two shots. One? Are you kidding me? Alright, Kordak, can you... 
That'll leave you with one action point, which might be enough to get you back in there. Good. Jesus! What was that? We haven't saved. That kind of sucks. And it's Hawk that went down. Uh, but Lucia has a little bit of first aid. So... Lucia... I don't think we can do this. Uh, I honestly think I'd rather just take a shot than get cordite up right now. Here. Hulk. You're actually pretty much full health. But let's use a medic pack on yourself. Seuss. 70% hit chance, 91% hit chance. You see a little bit, but it's fine. Uh, prepare. Come on, you can get two shots off. And defend. Chicken is gonna die, that's for sure. Jesus! Alright. Uh, oh. Get Lucia up. And med pack her. Much obliged. And she's poisoned as well. So we have some antidote somewhere, right? Yep. Uh Alright, and then you can defend Seuss. Oh, three health! Kidding me! So, both of those are just out of range. Kinda sucks. She'll finish that off then. Two shots at that thing. And defend. Lucia. Ooh, good hit. That was a very, very, very nice hit. Defend. It's good that they're going for the clone. 
Well, that thing is, at least. Oh, there goes the chicken. We have a tendency to kill every single chicken we find, don't, don't we? Thank you kindly. Mm. Let's see if we can't finish this thing off. Reload. Defend. Right, let's get the cord out. And then you can smack that thing. Fend. You see, uh, you can. I have to get all the way over there. Alright, good. Defend. So we can do it. I'll apply stun. Ooh. Uh, whoops. I want you to grab a stir fry thing. And eat that. And defend. Sixty eight. That's as good as it gets. Prepare. Thought I saw, yeah, 83 there. And 85 on that. I'm actually thinking that I want to go for the spiny hopper because it's poisonous and it has less health. Assisted poison, though. So that was kind of nice. Thank you kindly. Well, you're welcome. Whatever it is you're thanking me for. Head. Good hit. Good fun. Uh, you. Uh, requires weird science six. What do you have? Weird science. You have none. <laughs> mm. Does anyone have weird science? I don't think so. No. Alright, fine. Then. Could have thrown out something, but. I guess eat one of those again. Well, it's bleeding. Job. Defend. Seuss. We need to reload. We're out of ammo for that thing. Uh, 
Okay. That thing is dead. <laughs> Cordite is taking a pounding. Alright, Hulk. Come over here behind. Uh, stunning shockwave around you. Let's do try that. Stunned. Okay. Shoot it in the face. Doesn't really matter. Seuss, 68%. Will always be 68%, it seems. Pair, one, 83%. Try not to hit Cordite. See ya. Good hits. Alright. Let's let the Kordak get some hits in. Go. Oh! They just got poisoned, all of them. Let's get caught right up. Uh, let's heal Cordite. That's not poison, that's... Irradiated. Minus 30% max con. Ah, oh, it's just for a few seconds. Okay, uh, I think we'll grab some injury kits. Oh, she has a little up. Uh, I have seven points. Let's get armor modding up. And this is strength, coordination, and speed, yeah. Let's get that extra action point. Did you by chance level up? Yes, you did. Or, no, you didn't, did you? No. I don't think you did. I do have a perk. I don't remember. Did I leave a perk? Uh, barter, any pincher, antiques appraiser. Junk items not including scrap have a 5% chance of being sold for 40 times their value? Wow. I think I was saving that perk for something else. And I want lock picking up to six. And we don't have a lock picking book, do we? No. Kiss ass, explosives, sneaky shit, brawling, automatic weapons, weird science, and hard ass. 
Yeah. Oh, we need to re this thing. Captain, you and your men have retained, have retained on behalf of Mr. Buchanan and hold in your custody a pair of Eastern Plains Warlords. Mr. Buchanan wants these Warlords to remain under lock and key until further notice, and these authorized continued payments to be delivered to you as long as his wish is carried out. You should be advised that you are guarding two of the most dangerous individuals in the nation of Colorado. Ironclad Cordite rose up through the ranks of the Scar Collectors, no easy feat for anyone to accomplish, and still keep most of their organs inside of their body. The man is a fanatic for himself, totally convinced of his own grand destiny to rule all of creation, and he is willing to do anything to anyone to see that come true. Cloud Drifting West led a whole pack of fanatics as he, as head of the Godfishers. Those sealets are so crazy they think that this, his survival has defied the will of the gods. His replacement, the new leader of the Godfisher Star that Dreams, is reportedly dead set on finding him so that he can appease those gods by killing clouds. Be on the lookout for them, for the, for them and don't let word you are holding cloud, clouds spread. Finally, and just as important to remember, no one is to question otherwise interrogate quarter of clouds drifting west, except for Mr. Buchanan himself. You and your men are instructed to keep them well fed and in fair shape, and that is all. There is no need for conversing with either of them. Your next payment will follow on schedule as before. One nation, one father, signed the patriarch. Dictated, not read, to diligent Joe. Okay. Weird. Right, so Hawk, you should probably heal a bit. Then I think the uh, injury kit will use on yourself. Cordite has something as well, shell shock and chills. And Lucia has something. Lucia. All right. And Cordite. Alright, so that's everyone fully fit. Good. Let's... Is there... I thought there was something to loot on one of these, yeah. Toad skin. And toad tongue. Okay. Twisted hydraulic. Toxic spines. Junk. And there's a pamphlet. Bunker pamphlet lore book. Made of glossy heavy paper, the ancient brochure is faded and flecked with mold. What's that? Live like there's no tomorrow. When disaster strikes, the executive series bunker by Best Bunker provides the ultimate in safety, security, and comfort for you and your loved ones. Prepared for the worst, encased in... Uh, a layered shell of proprietary alloys and ceramic fill for impact-proof, radiation-proof, hermetically sealed underground living. All the comforts of home. The world won't rebuild itself overnight, so the executive series is designed to, for a long-term lifestyle. Features fully furnished rooms, state-of-the-art generators, water recycling, color videos of every major motion picture released between 1950 to 1991, and carpets. Built to thrive. Cannot Canned peaches? You're better than that. Enjoy fresh products from your very own hydroponics bay, then indulge in a variety of gourmet prepackaged meals. Contact your local Best Bunker representative today for a free consultation. Best Bunker for the rest of your life. <laughs> okay. Uh, then there was an, a weapon crate here. Oh, saw blade cestus. Falling weapon, that's the same that he has now, isn't it? Quarter. And a grenade box. Crate. Uh, 
cryo grenade. Okay. And is there anything else? Sour provisions. The safe book stack. Well, I guess we'll check the book stack. Ooh, skill book. Increases first aid by one. Nice. Loot that. Pair of that. And let's check out what's in here. There's a fan. And that's about it. Whoa! That hurt. Thanks, dude. I did not see that trap at all. Tiny words are embossed into the vents, metal uh, slats, part ID, blah, blah, blah. For repairs, contact your author authorized service representative. Okay. On our authorized maintenance, will avoid your prudent planning company Thanks, warranty. Dude. Okay. All right. Well, nothing else of interest in here. So I guess we're done with the bunker. So. Guess we're heading out. And there's nothing here, right? No, I I looted everything here, I think. Alright. So in the next one, we'll head back to uh, Ranger HQ uh, because I, I actually don't want to have Cordite with us. I want uh, someone else back. I, I don't need two uh, melee guys, I think. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. So, in between episodes, I'll uh, take us back to uh, Ranger HQ and then we'll be back there. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.